Hey y'all, welcome back to another video. So in today's video, we're going to be going over the entryway makeover in my home. This was um, one of my favorite projects so far in the house um, because it's one of the first spaces that people see when they walk into your home. So I wanted to give you guys a little bit of information um, about the entryway. So first we're gonna start off with these beautiful videos of what it's looking like now. And I'm gonna take you back real quick. Here's the before, okay? The entryway was very, very boring, very blah. We had this table at our previous home. We didn't even have an entryway in our previous home. And so we literally just took it and set it down in our entryway here. My husband found a woodworker who was able to actually build this piece for us. We gave him the dimensions um, and he produced this piece. Now it is unfinished because we told him we wanted to stain it ourselves. And so um, that's what we did. So this was the outcome that we got after staining it. We used a brown stain and a very deep dark stain that made it almost black. So it gave us kind of an end result of a medium toned brown. During the fall season, we um, styled the table how you see here, um, but I still wasn't satisfied with it. And so now we have how it's styled now. As you can see, we've done a lot of things to just kind of make the space feel um, how we want it to feel, including adding a rug and also um, little decorative elements on the surface of the table. All right, and so the staining was something that my husband and I both did together um, just to make the process go a little faster. On the wall behind is a, an old map that I taped off, put spackle on, and then painted over just to give me the look that I was going for for the wall art. And I did add some color to it. You'll see that a little bit later. On this clip here, you can tell that there's wood grain going vertically and horizontally. That is what I would just consider to be a casualty of having um, a woodworker do this and not having a machine made piece. And so, I mean, it bothers me, but it's not the end of the world. And so this is just another view of the top. I'm also going to go underneath and show you all the underside um, of the table to show you that I did not stain the underside um, just because I don't believe that there will be anyone that's going underneath there to look at it. Eventually, maybe I'll stain it, but right now it's going to remain how it is. And you all can see that horizontal um, staining on the left hand side. On the very top, we've got two candlestick holders and white candlesticks. Um, from Facebook Marketplace. These were a steal. We did have to drive a little far across town to get them, but I do absolutely love them and how they make this space look. Also, you can tell that there's wood filler in some of the spaces on this table, and so the stain does not take to wood filler very well, um, but we still stained it. And here's how the painting looks with some color. I'm not sure that I love it, but I can always paint over it again if I would like to. That is pretty much the finished look, guys. If you're interested in any item um, on this video, I will most definitely include it in the cards or the description box below. So please make sure to check that if you want any more details. But that is the entryway styling.